All right, on lying on your back, knees bent, feet flat, drop your knees to one side, hold the twist. This is just such a good, like I'm stretching and I'm also just like flopping on the floor <laughs> to recover from what we just did. Up and over to the other side. Shoulder blades are touching the mat. And bring it back to the center. Knees are bent, feet on the floor. Now raise one leg up toward the ceiling. Hold it with your hands. Push your tail to the floor. Push your heel to the ceiling. You're going to feel a deep stretch without having to pull your leg too much um, closer to your torso. But if you're very flexible in the hamstrings, you might need to pull your leg toward you. Try to straighten the knee a little bit, tail down, heel up. Get the back of that leg as long as you can. Toes are flexed toward the shin bone. Woo. Need to stretch today. I feel like I'm still recovering from being in the car. <laughs> And now take that ankle, cross it over the opposite knee, and then hug both of those bent legs toward you. Use that knee to drive that leg toward you. The strength of that leg. And relax there. Now, other leg goes straight up toward the ceiling. Flex the ankle. Push the tail to the floor, push the heel to the ceiling. What happens when you have tight hamstrings is your tailbone is peeling away from the floor. Push it down, reach through the heel. Support with your hands if you need to. Cross that ankle over the opposite knee. Bring both legs up toward you. Use that knee to push the leg toward you, your chest. Yeah, you're gonna relax out of that. I find myself spacing out, I'm tired. <laughs> Go to hands and knees. Square up and then set one leg out to the side. Inner edge of my foot is on the floor and I want you to rock forward and back. Loosen up the hip and the inner thigh groin area. Some rocking first, because this can be a little intense. And then sit back toward your heel. You can go to your elbows until you feel a good stretch on the inner thighs. And come forward, bring that knee in. Now that same leg that was out to the side, come up to your knees and take that leg and step forward. So you're in a kneeling position and now lean into that leg. Now we're stretching the quad muscle on the other, on the back leg there. Tuck your tailbone just a little bit between your legs and you're gonna feel a deeper stretch right up into that hip flexor on the other side. And come out of that nice and easy. And then we're gonna do the other side. I have to turn around because I don't have room. Hands and knees, other leg goes out to the side. It's a better view actually. Rock forward and back. And then go ahead and sit back. Sit back, go to your elbows if it feels better or deeper. I feel like on this side, it's a little different. Lopsided. Mm 
All right, back to hands and knees, nice and easy. Bring that leg in, go to your knees, and then that same leg steps forward, half kneeling position, lean into it. Now notice my front knee is not going past my toes, so I have a big step forward with that foot. That would be bad pressure. And then sink into it, tuck your tail just a little bit. That back leg's gonna get a good stretch. And come out of that a little bit for upper body. Hands and knees, you're gonna thread the needle. I'm gonna face forward. You're gonna take an arm, go under the body, set the shoulder and head down. Reach as far away as you can. And then that hand that's still pushing with the palm against the floor, you can push into that just a little bit and you're gonna deepen that rotation. And up and out of that. And then we have to thread the needle with the other arm. Reach under long, set the shoulder head down. So that whole arm is laying on the floor. The hand with the palm facing the ground can push gently, not much, just a little, you'll know. You always wanna press into feeling a stretch, but don't overdo it. Not trying to break any records. It takes time to get deeper in stretches. Time and consistency. Yeah, nice and easy up out of that. Go ahead and sit, legs crossed or legs straight, whatever's comfortable, hands behind you, fingertips pointed away, chest goes forward and up, squeeze shoulder blades together. Spread that open through the front. You can look up gently. And relax out of that. We're all done for today. Thank you for coming.